four years ago, part of 26th Street in Charles Village caved in, collapsing onto the railroad tracks below. Monday, a similar situation just a couple of blocks away at 26th and Calvert. The sidewalk buckling, then slowly collapsing. I don't think you'll ever get used to anything like this happening. You know? I think it's pretty heartbreaking to see uh, once again a, an instance of uh, our city's um, pretty historic infrastructure failing. People who live in the area stopped by Tuesday to watch the work as crews remove the sidewalk and dismantle the retaining wall before a new one can be built. They wonder how this happened again. They should have really uh, checked out the whole line, I, I suppose, you know, to make sure, to see if there were any other areas that could, uh, you know, or cave in. City Department of Transportation officials tell 11 News they did inspect the entire stretch of retaining wall after the collapse in 2014, but have not inspected it since. There are no laws requiring them to do so. Some residents say that's concerning. It's also scary to imagine that, you know, kids have been walking up and down this street for years with the potential threat of uh, this uh, aging infrastructure uh, to collapse into the train tunnel. Another worry, the fact that there is an elementary school and playground nearby. There were kids playing in the playground yesterday. Is that safe right there? You know, the playground's right over the tracks. One city councilman says it's time for another inspection. I want to work with DOT and emergency management, and we're going to do a walk to make sure we can look at all these side streets to make sure there's no structural damage anywhere under the ground. Crews will be out here 24 hours a day, including all night monitoring the situation. But the City Department of Transportation says it's going to be at least several days before the work is done. Reporting live in North Baltimore, Kim Dacey, WPAL TV 11 News. <laughs>